I wanted to go through my um, box that I just bought and um, I'm really excited about it. So it is the Cosmetip um, Shannon XO The Beauty Box. Um, I got this for Christmas for myself. That was my big gift. Um, and so it is, I did get into it beforehand because I was excited. So um, it comes with a really amazing um, lipstick um, package, like shutter sticker. And it's really nicely um, wrapped. I did go, however, through it first and open it because again, I was excited. So, um, this is a, um, just get ready with me. I'm going to breakfast with my best friend of 22 years, um, this morning. And so I'm really excited. We're going to go Goodwill shopping, which is, you know, to breakfast and then Goodwill shopping. Woohoo! First Friday. So in Indiana, that's a big deal. Um, so I got the Natasha Denona um, Sunset Palette in, in here, and so I'm excited about that. Um, I also got Lily Lashes. Um, I don't know if I'll be wearing these today. Um, my allergies and I feel like I'm getting a little bit of a cold, so my eyes are watering. I do have dry eyes. I'm a little bit older, um, so my eyes hate me sometimes. Um, beautiful, unique, um, amazing. Danish skincare. Now I have used this a couple times. I've gotten some of this um, in my um, Fun Fab Fit box or Fit Fab Fun box. I never say it right. Um, and I've gotten some stuff from BoxyCharm too, um, which I love my BoxyCharm boxes. Um, Face Halo, which is one of those washers. Amazing. I'm excited about that. And then the Glow Glam um, Glow Setter. This is going to be fun. And the one thing I've been really looking forward to is the Tatcha. I see so many of the um, YouTubers using this and um, I hear so many good things about it. And I like believe in primer because as you get older, um, your skin, it decides it likes to sag. I didn't used to have pores. And now I have pores that I can actually see, which is a bummer because <laughs> I never knew. I, I just didn't know. So, um, so yeah, let's get started, guys. So this Tatcha, it comes with a little scoop. Um, it's so pretty. The packaging is amazing on this. I mean, ultimately, it's beautiful. So um, I've never used this. I do have Tatcha. Um, I use their um, oil um, to cleansing oil to wash my face. Um, and I've had that for years and I love it. I got it off the of QVC, so it was a really good deal. Um, I got their rice exfoliator and, um, and then that cleansing oil. So I know that they say you don't eat a lot, so I'm just going to take just about that much. Um, this is very expensive, so that's why I got the box. Um, the box itself, um, so because it's... Um, coming from London, you've got to pay um, the London money. Uh, so, in American dollars, it equates out to about $164, which is a lot, but um, considering you're getting all this, this um, generally all of this together would be about $500. So, um, I feel like that's a really good deal. And for the one big Christmas present I got, um, I, w I wanted to justify it. I work really hard and I would not be able to afford this without it being in this box. So I'm very excited. Um, I do, I, I have been able to work with another D Natasha Denona palette through BoxyCharm. So um, I got the Cranberry palette last month, I think it was, and it's amazing and I love it. So I really like warm palettes and um, yeah. I'm going to put this back, a little scooper thing, so I don't have to lose it. Okay. 
so it makes your skin feel slightly tacky, but it, it smells so good. It smells like um, if you were at a massage place and they were putting all natural um, facial scrubs and moisturizers on you, and it does leave your face beyond soft. That's so nice. Those. Um, so I do not use a lot of um, foundation. I just don't. I don't. I never have. My mom never ever wore makeup when I was growing up. So um, unless she was going out and it was just a little bit of blush, a little bit of lipstick and eyeliner and mascara, she didn't really wear. She never wore foundation. She still really doesn't to this day. Um, so I am going to use my um, my concealer, which is what I always do. And that's just my own little ninja way. Um, I like just to conceal and call it a day because I got it in my purse. So I generally carry it. Um, and right now I am lighter than I generally am. Um, I am Latina which, um, if you didn't know, I am. Um, and this is just nude. I Sorry guys, this is not been nude. Recently. It's actually I'm beige. Um, I like the sun. <laughs> but sometimes the sun doesn't like me. I have a little bit of melasma on my face from being pregnant with my um, older daughter, who's four now. I got it from um, being in the sun pregnant with her and I did not know that that was a possibility <laughs> so um, now I just conceal it up and, um, and then I use a little bit of concealer on my wonderful little dark eyes and I use my fingers sometimes I use my um, also, this Too Faced Born This Way Hydrating Concealer. My um, blending little sponge. I have a beauty blender and I have some more off brands and I have a new technique one. I kind of like my fingers. Um, I went to art school and worked in wood. I was a furniture designer. Um, and I always wanted to do hair and makeup. Um, but my guidance counselor was not a wonderful guidance counselor. So she told me I'd never go to college. Wasn't college material. I was like, cussed her out up and down. And then did it myself. So, haha. -ha. So I'm going to use the Becca. Um, this is Hydra Mist and set and refresh powder. This stuff is crazy. It feels wet because it's so cold um, when it goes on your skin. And um, so I got this really amazing little um, brush. It's a Lexon and I got it in a little kit with um, another one. I love this brush. Um, I feel like it's just amazing in the way that it covers and again I'm a little bit older than a general um, makeup influencer um, but I feel like there was not any of me out there um, so I was like I'm gonna do this and see what we do with this so um, But, here's a kicker, when you're a little bit older, you can't use a lot of powders in, in all of that. You, you just, it doesn't, it doesn't work out, it doesn't. So, um, if you look and you feel like, oh, I'm super dry, um, you just spray some of your setting spray, wet it all down, and then let it air dry, and then it, it kind of dissolves into your face. So, that's at least a plus. Um, because sometimes, mm -mm, mm -mm, nope, doesn't work. Um, okay, so let's go into the palette. 
So the Natasha Denona Sunset Palette. It's got this amazing little plastic cover and it is beautiful. It's beautiful. So I'm excited to get into it. Um, I think it's really neat how they have this really thick um, plastic cover on there. It's really nice. It keeps you in line with what you're um, trying to go for. So um, I am going to use my little um, Sorry guys, this is, it's Alan. This is Alan uh, Kathleen Mike's friend. Cannot remember how Kathleen Mike says it, it. It's, but it's just yeah, no, it's no joke. Um, never worn glasses in my life, and now I'm like, <laughs> it's ridiculous. Um, am I reading it upside down? I don't think so. Oh yes, I am. Mm -hmm. Um, Alasar, 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 we're going to go with that. Um, she has done some really, really amazing, um, eye palettes and she's done some, um, lipsticks now and I've gotten her eye palette through BoxyCharm, these through BoxyCharm and, um, I believe her gloss through BoxyCharm. Um, so I'm going to start out with, um this middle orange right here and that is called Horizon. Now I know that this is expensive but sometimes a girl's gotta live so you know I'm a mom of four. Um, I work really hard. I'm a, a guidance counselor. I'm a director of student services and um, that in itself just is a lot of work and I feel like you know sometimes you've got to have some fun and so um, this is my fun right here so that's where we're at this is this is my my I am excited love kind of thing um, That goes on so freaking smooth. And there's not a lot of kickback, which is really awesome. That's pretty. That's pretty. Um, next, I'm going to go into Terra. Terra, which is the more brown shade right here in the corner. It doesn't look that brown, it looks almost orange, but okay, now you can see it's more brown. So, and I'm just gonna put that in my crease. So think about a windshield wiper or a blade, and you don't wanna put it down too hard. You just wanna, and you can roll it in a circle. You just wanna spread that beautiful color on your lid. And you don't ever wanna go up into this right here, your highlight bone, you want to leave that because you're going to highlight that later. And if you put color up there, it's going to be a pain in the Heineken to remove that color. So, and I want this all over my lid. Well, I'm sorry, my, um, oh my God, Wendy Wheeler, my crease. <clears throat> I don't really want it on my lid. I want my lid to stay a little bit lighter. So it's gonna look like a sunset. And then I'm gonna go out and have breakfast and enjoy my day with my best friend. I haven't seen in forever. We have like an hour apart and we're so busy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Okay, I am going to go in with um Penjun. It's the red color. So this red color right here. And I'm gonna really, see how that goes on. Jesus, that is beautiful. I'm also gonna put this down just a little right here. It's in my corner. I 
I didn't used to understand when people were like, oh, it's getting muddy. I was like, what? And then the more I did makeup, um, I was such a tomboy growing up. You wouldn't think that, right? I know. Um, I was such a tomboy. I was one of the guys. And that's what they called me. I didn't call myself that. I was like, ah, uh, guys, kind of missing a few pieces. Saying. But, um, you never thought that I would be like, oh, I'm into makeup and whatever. But my sister Stephanie was like all into makeup and hair and, you know, doing all of that kind of stuff. Um, so she taught me, she's like, if you ever want to get a boyfriend, you have to grow your hair out and look more girly. Because I always had a really short haircut with the, it was cut to feather. Dude, it was rocking. I loved my hair. Um, I'm going to do, it's going to be interesting. I'm going to do a little bit of this yellow, which is soul. I want to do that on my crease. Because I want like this under color. And I am not changing my brushes. I, I know. I, I just love this brush. I could. Man, that comes up. Do you hear me? That is that is a show up and I'm keen to play and slay, baby. Wow. Okay, it's so weird. So you have to look over here for the camera, but you want to see what it looks like. So you want to look at it. So then your eye shift, that's annoying. And then if I want to look in my big mirror, I'm up here which is, I don't even know where my eyes go there. So, hmm, yeah. I generally wear my hair in a messy bun. That's just me. It makes life easier. I think it's just because I have my hair short so long and I love it short. Um, currently, however, it's not short, it's very long. And I like it, I just am lazy. I have two little girls. I have, I have four children. <laughs> I had one in high school at 17. I don't recommend it, it's hard. It makes life so much harder. Um, if you can wait, you should. You're not ready at 17. Um, I luckily I had such a good support system, and my mom loved me, and and she was super good to me and helped me. She was laid off, so she helped me a lot. Um, well, you know, I was going to school and working full time at Baskin Robbins, um, and I worked through it and uh, managed to graduate and um, took a year off and then went to college. And so I was very lucky, you know, was very, very lucky. Oh my gosh, this brown is no joke. I didn't think it was gonna be that brown. Um, I'm only, I think I'm gonna dip into that one time. No, I guess I gotta do it twice. Oh Jesus. Um, if you get this palette, oh my God, be light. So Shannon Exo still has this uh, on her site. Um, you have to, it's the easiest thing to go through her site on YouTube. It's so much easier to get to it. I tried to do it just through the, um, typing it in and I was not lucky enough to be able to access it. So, um, I really don't want this everywhere. I just want a little bit of a darker. There we go. Look at there. I'm gonna mix some of that red back in there. I don't wanna lose my red. I just wanted to darken it up slightly. I'm gonna do red and that orange, or that more terracotta and red, so that I don't lose that color, but I wanted it just slightly darker. I mean, it's, it is morning. I don't want it. <laughs> I don't want it too dark, but I want it popping so yeah where we're at and I'm just doing this on my iPhone so um I have a really nice iPhone I was really blessed to be able to get that so um again I work really hard and I um, love my job I love my students but I also want to 
do other things and be artistic and so this is the way it can be. Ah, okay. Um, I used that yellow so I really want to go in with this um, Sundays which is that gold right here. Right here. So um, I'm going to use my finger. When I apply these glitters um, I really like to use my finger and sometimes I wet down my finger. Look at that, that's so pretty. And see, I put the yellow under it because that yellow just makes it stand out even more. Now I have the smallest freaking lids ever. Okay, maybe not ever. There are people with smaller lids. Dude. All right. Okay, and then I'm gonna do um, ice gold. I wanna put ice gold in the middle, just so in the center. And it doesn't necessarily just kind of intensifies that one spot. That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna do a little bit on my lower line now. Mm -mm. This wheeler can't do a lot. You know, again, being older, things tend to like whoop, go down my face, and that's just not cute. Mm -mm. So I'm gonna use um, Tara. Mm. Mm. I love this palette. Okay. That being said, that is pretty. Um, I am next going to use this. Now I have eyebrows. I'm so lucky. I stopped blocking those suckers when I was like 28 because I used to do the very skinny little eyebrow kind of thing and I was like um yeah I don't know about that so I just use this fill it in a little bit sometimes I don't like the big square looking ones I'm just drawing my finger across it so it gets its shape and then you know I think that's good to get my eyebrows done. That's one reason for um, doing this. I don't have like, my eyebrow. What are you doing, Wheeler? Whoa, ho, ho. Okay, so this is um, Luxie 221 T. The Travel Series. Um, and so I'm going to go back into that um, ice gold. Is that that right there? Do that like a nice little highlight.
Damn girl. Mm. Now here's my problem with this. Because my eyes leak like they're psycho crazy, and I'm, seeping, I'm digging out sweet boogers, this is a pointless endeavor. It's pointless to me. Because I'm always messing with my freaking eyes. Anyway, I still try. <laughs> I don't know how long it's gonna last. I really don't. But I still try. Bring that light in there, girl. Come on. All right. Okay. Did that. Put that away. Um, so I had this really nice, um, bronzer. What happened to it? It got broken. It got completely jacked, which is so upsetting. Anyway, so I don't know. I'm not gonna be able to go get it because it's gonna take too long. Oh, still, I gotta do my eyes. Finish that. I need to finish that. Finish your eyes, Wendy Wheeler. Okay, so I'm gonna use um, Too Faced Better Than Sex um, Deepest Black. I need to get some brown. I haven't gotten any brown yet, so um, I need some brown. Especially with eye looks like this. I love black, but I need some brown, so. Here you have it. So to do this, I just do small strokes first. And I look forward, not into like, into the pencil. If you look into the pencil, dude, it's no good. So just look forward at the line in the mirror. And that generally will keep you from blinking. If you feel yourself gonna blink, move your, move your, um, the tip so that it doesn't, screw up your eye because it's just harder to fix, especially with lighter colors on, you know, than to, okay, so my wing, here's we go. This is my art school trick. So your wing should face your eyebrow, right? So if you can just imagine a line that comes up right here, that's where your wing should be. Um, now I try and get mine just a little bit higher than my crease because I do tend to I have dry eyes and so my eye leaks which is so annoying but it does it leaks um, and so it will it'll run so just again imagine it up here and then you're going to bring it down in a little cat ear like that and then you're gonna fill your little cat ear up not perfect but it's okay now my eye um, it's not shaped the same and so whenever I go get my eyebrows done I have to be like very okay so see how I'm just like closing it together now um, and then I'm thickening the edge up just so that it matches because that's just like a very blunt cat eye so I'm gonna pull my face a little Nah, I don't care. It's all good. So again, I, I lay my pinky down so I have a steady hand. I don't just float my my pen, my pen along the, my eye. This one tends to blink a little bit more. And again, though, you're, you're crossing, so you're gonna have a little bit more mess up or maybe blinking. That's what I would say. This eye is just more particular. And, you know, if you mess up, that's okay. You can fix it. Just kind of draw that line over it. Hopefully it's not too thick. You don't want to ruin all the work you did on your, um, on your eyelid. So, again, and I can't make mine very thick because my eyelid disappears. Y'all, it disappears if I make this line too thick. So, you know little error okay okay so I'm gonna kind of look at this and go okay so here and I'm gonna kind of do try to do the same thing now I'm not always perfect right I'm not just not 
and then you come back like a little cat ear. And see how pretty that one was? That one was perfect. Oh, and I just went out of line. Oh, Wendy, what are you doing? Okay, now, <laughs> now it's way more blunt like the other one. How about that, George? My kids think I'm money. I call them George all the time. My name is not George Mom. I know, Georgina. Shut up and sit down. <laughs> so, I worked at um, inner city schools. I loved my kiddos. I grew up in the inner city school. Um, I went to Fluid Central, and then I went to more of a, a suburban school when we moved to Indiana. I um, grew up in Flint, Michigan, in the epicenter of the water crisis. I just messed that up. So with this, I literally just am putting some color down and then taking it off. Just, just slightly, again, with my fingers, because that's high roll. Um, but I carry this in my purse. I love this. Um, and I see, as you can see, my eyeball, it's watering like it's crazy. No reason. No reason. Just likes to torture me as much as humanly possible. Okay. So, uh, this is, um, Superhero It. Oh my God. This, this shit right here, right here. It's, it's amazing. I love it. So you're going to get it as close as you can without like making yourself blink and you're going to kind of go back and forth because that's going to give you the rise you need. Now, I, my eyelashes, I'm very lucky they already curl. So I very, very rarely curl them and I have long lashes. Crazy as that is. You just never can see them because my hair is so fine. So um, when I use mascara, it's like, what girl, you got, you got lashes for days. I do. You just never see them. So, that being said. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Blinking like I'm crazy. Look at that. That is beautiful. And see, you can't see my eyelash on the other eye. Girl got lashes. She put some color on there. Okay, I won. I too. <laughs> anyway. You wanna look up, shimmy and shake a little bit. And get that lash all the way. And you wanna be slow about how you blink. You don't want to blink fast because you want all of that love, loveliness of your mascara on your lid. Or not, not on your lid. On your eyelash. Jesus. Those lashes, girls. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Got to get quicker here. I'm gonna be late, and my best friend will just be like, "I love you." All right. So, I got this um, Ciate London um, in my Lux box. Mm, mm, mm. This shit is the bomb. This is nice. <gasps> I think I forgot to give it to my. Son's um, girl or fiance. It's like amazing. This stuff is beautiful. 
you have to be careful and you can't, I don't think you can be too, too, like, connected to wear this. Um, because it's got a lot of beautiful color in it. Um, and it just makes you look so freaking wet. Oh my god. And when you're older, again, when you're older, um, you tend to get dry. You know? It's just life. It's just life happening. Melinda decided to jump up on my nose this morning. I was like, Melinda, girl, what are you doing on my face? She just wanted to share. She wanted to share. She wanted to feel the love. What? That's right. Feel the love train. Okay, a little on my upper lip. I, I'm a little weird. I, I know everybody likes it on their upper lip. I think it almost makes me look sweaty and it's just generally strange. So I only like just a small pad. I will put a little bit here too, not a lot. Miss Wheeler don't need a lot. Dude, because I don't need to look all sweaty. It needs to look like they're sweating out of their whole face. That's, that's not cute to me. That might be cute to other people. To me, I don't like that. Not on my face. Oh no. One prayer. No. <laughs> All right, so look at that. That is beautiful. Okay. We're getting there. Whoop, Jesus. Don't drop. Don't break. Mm -mm, I need you. Okay, so I got this NYX. This is the second time I bought this. The first one, it broke, it cracked everywhere, and then. My daughters like to get into my makeup, so I have, I have four kids, I, I told you that, and I stopped. Uh, so I have a son, Timothy, he's 27. I have a son, Chance, he's 17. Um, I have a daughter who is named Piper, she is four years old. Um, and then I have Willow, who is two, who is almost three. She'll be three next month. So, holy, holy mackerel. Do you hear me? Holy mackerel. Okay, anyways, so they touched it and it fell, my broken little thing. And it went down the sink. <gasps> oh God, I'm so upset. So this is um, Citrine Rose, and it's by NYX, Citrine Rose, and I love it. So how about that? And this is my little blush um, brush, and it's a Luxie 522 Tapered Highlight. Yeah, it's Tapered Highlight, and I didn't tell you what this one is. This one is, I, I use this one for my highlight. How funny is that? This is um, a Luxie 516 Dual Fiber Powder Brush, and I use this for my highlight. I don't know why I like it, though. I've used this for my highlight brush forever, since I got it, basically. And this I use for my blush. And this has already got a crack in it. I don't, I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. Oh, well. And this also is a beautiful, like, shimmery kind of um, blush. So whatever. A little more shimmer to my little uh, face. I'm down, baby. Give me some, give me some love. Mm. So yeah, it's going to be a fun day. I haven't seen my best friend in like almost a year and uh, she had a baby and it's just been busy. She um, drives all over the place. Um, she's in corporate and so she's a safety manager and I know her job just recently changed um, a little bit, but she still has to audit these stores. And so um, she's all over driving. And so when she gets tired, um, she just, you know, she wants to veg. And I get that. So do I. Um, I used to drive a long ways to work um, when I worked at Arsenal Tech. Um, and every day. Um, and now I don't drive as far. I still drive, but not as far. And so it's, it's lovely. It's so nice. Um, okay. I like that. Okay. So, what else do I need to feel like I'm done? Oh, my lips. Yeah, my lips done. And then I'll spray, and then I will, um, I don't want any color. Okay, so this is ColourPop, and this is, um, I believe my best friend. 
is what it's called. Oh, I guess I gotta turn it this way, huh? BFF3, and it's brown. Um, and, uh, so I have a problem with these. I don't know why they do this, but once the first initial um, sharp part is gone and you have to um, sharpen it, it just it, like falls out, I don't know why. So then I just tap it back in. We looking a lot extra crazy now. I know I don't do a lot. I do not cover my whole lip. I very rarely do that. I might do that today though. I like I like the lighter piece to to be a natural highlight. Um, however, sometimes that doesn't work out. So, whatever, George. I could go with a really, really bright red. I don't want to do that. Um, I guess we're gonna go with this one. It's um, Becca, mm. and it is sorbet. Okay. This is such a nice, such a nice lipstick. It's so smooth when it goes on. Okay, and then I know I don't think they they sell this anymore, but it's the Pirates of the Caribbean um, by Lorac, and it's um, the Trident colors. So those colors. Now listen, it's not really. I mean, it's lighter than that, but at least on me. And this is so smooth too. Look at my shiny lips. Mmm. Okay, so. That's how you get, see that? That's the inside of your lips. And if you bite them, you won't get lipstick on your teeth. Just not bite them, but close them. So you don't get lipstick on your teeth. You know, it's dirty. But it works. Okay, George. Mm, and then she's done. A little more. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, mm -mm, no. I don't even know if I have to shake this, but I'm shaking it. All right, so I'm gonna use a glow setter and That smells good. It sounds like you're at a spa. Okay, y'all. Miss Wheeler with hair down. Crazy hair. Yes. <laughs> and I still gotta put my earrings on. I'll get that done later. But yeah, it's gonna it's gonna look really super cute. I feel like I got a piece of both in my hair. All right, so that's the look, guys. Mm. 
and um, I hope you liked it. Um, again, for those of us that are over 40, this is um, how I do my makeup. I don't want it sitting in my little bit of creases that I do have, and um, I do generally, um, I don't really contour a lot, but sometimes. But again, my um, bronzer is broken, so, because I would usually hide all the love um, along my face, and I'd contour a little bit on my cheeks, but you know, it's just a get ready with me, and I have a piece of fuzz in my hair, and um, just a girl's day out, so I'm really excited. Um, I hope you guys have a blessed day and um, just enjoy the remainder of um, the weekend. Have a good one. And it was nice to see you and chit chat with you and um, get ready with me. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that yet. Um, and hit that bell notification so you know when I upload a video. Talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.